Hello, my name is Maria and this is Mathy, my mascot. In this lesson we're going to do some comparisons between numbers and also between additions. Basically, this is like an alligator mouth lesson. What's that, Mathy? A mammoth mouth lesson, right? Now, first, I want to show you that here's an equal sign. And so 5 equals 5, right? Simple. And 4 equals... 3 plus 1. You see, on this side we have 3 and 1, so that makes a total of 4. So there's 4 here on this side, and 4 on this side, so 4 equals 4. 4 equals 3 plus 1. And then here we have less than sign, 6 is less than 8. And then here we have greater than sign, 2 plus 4 is greater than 3. 2 plus 4 makes a total of 6. And 6 is greater than 3. Over here in these blue boxes we need to now write the alligator's mouth, one way or the other. 7, and then on this side 2 plus 4. Which one is more? Okay, 2 plus 4 is the same as 4 plus 2 is 6. 6 and 7. 7 is more. 7 is greater than 6. Here's 10 and here's 5 plus 3. How much was 5 and 3? 5 and 3 makes 8. 10 is greater than 8. 6 plus 2. Well, that's 8, right? So 8 is less than 9. And then here, 3 plus 4. That's 7. And 7. Now we use the equals. There. Over here, on this empty line goes a number. We need to pick this or this or this number Go to go on the empty line so that this comparison here is true. For example, if I try 6 here, 6 less than 3. That's not right, so 6 won't fit. 2. 2 is less than 3. That works. How about here? Something is equal to 5. Which number of these is equal to 5? Well, 5, of course. Like that. Now here, 2 plus something is less than 4. Does this look difficult? Just try each number. If I put 1 here, 2 plus 1, that's 3. 3 is less than 4, so that works. I guess I don't need to try these two. Over here, 5, 6, and 3. Which one would go here? Just try. If I put 5 here, 5 plus 5 would be 10. 8 equals 10. No, that won't work. Can you see which one will work? 3 will work. 8 equals 3 plus 5. More alligator mouth problems here. 2 plus 2 here, and 3 plus 2 on the other side. Which one is more? Well, 3 plus 2 will be more. That's where the mammoth mouth has to open. 4 and 4 on this side, and 3 and 3 on that side. Which one will be more? You don't actually have to add. 4 and 4 will surely be more than 3 and 3. So 4 plus 4 is greater than 3 plus 3. 5 plus 1, well, that's 6. 4 plus 2, also 6. So these two are equal. Then 7 plus 3 makes 10. 6 plus 2 makes 8. 10 is greater than 8, that way. True or false? Is this true? 5 equals 6 plus 1. 6 plus 1 actually equals 7, so no, this is not true, it's false. 2 plus 7, or 7 plus 2? 9, yeah, this is 9. 4 plus 5 is also 9. It is just one less than 5 plus 5. So this is correct, this is true. Mary has $5. Remember this symbol, it means dollar, this means $5. Mary has $5 of money. Matthew has seven dollars, so Matthew has more. Then Mary gets three dollars more. Now who has more money now? Okay, how much does Mary have now? Mary used to have five, Mary gets three more. Now Mary has five plus three. That's eight. And so Mary has more money now. Eight is greater than seven. Mary has more money now. Matthew picked two buckets of blueberries. 
Yum, yum. You like blueberries, don't you? Right, he loves blueberries. Then he picked three more buckets. Oh my. Later he picked one more bucket. Who wrote this word problem? Matthew? <laughs> then he ate them all. Is Matthew full now? Matthew? That's not a math word problem. You think, you think Matthew is full now? He's eaten lots of blueberries. He's full now, right? I think he's full. But we need to change this problem because it's not a math word problem. What kind of question can we ask that would use these numbers in the problem? Think. See, Matthew picked two buckets and then picked three more buckets and then later he picked one more bucket. What can we ask? What, how can we use those numbers? Let's ask how many buckets Matthew picked. Or we can ask how many bucketfuls of blueberries did Matthew eat? The answer would be two plus three plus one. And that makes six. He ate six bucketfuls of blueberries. Now he's full. Okay, we're all done with this lesson.